Hello folks, I uh, hope you're all fine. In this video, I'm going to install the SSL certificate on my website. Uh, this is a domain and you can see the padlock and it's showing that not secure. So be, uh, in order to make it secure, in order to direct the, the, the traffic through HTTPS, we need to install the SSL certificate. Uh, all right, okay, so I go to the website backend first. Okay, uh, go to plugins and uh, there is a, a plugin we need to install and activate. Add new plugin. Uh, search for WP encryption. Uh, this is a plugin WP encryption want uh, one click free SSL certificate I have already installed and activated this is a very good one uh, with this one you do need to actually it has a paid version also uh, but uh, we are using the free version here let me scroll down when you install and activate uh, here you will have an option WP encryption just click on that Uh, all right, so in here you need to generate the SSL certificate uh, uh, First let me click on upgrade to compare the free with the paid uh, Version, okay, this is the pro and the free for the free uh, So everything you need to set up the main value, but for the pro of course it has uh, uh, Some advantages, uh, but anyway free version is also okay for us all right so i just click on wp encryption to generate the ssl certificate uh, type your email address here uh, check this one it will just send uh, some data it, it's good for the performance future performance and i agree and i agree of course we need to agree and generate the ssl certificate all right okay this is the first part and uh, this one is domain verification so uh, since we are using the free version uh, we need to there are a few steps that we need to do them manually http challenge and dns challenge uh, which is the domain verification if you use the pro version then uh, these steps are automatic but it's okay you just do it manually the first thing is that you need to download this file http challenge okay in the download folder uh, okay so now you need to log in to your hosting account and you need to uh, follow these steps uh, although here it is the video tutorial for this one also for this one also you can watch that uh, okay I, I already downloaded step one step to open HTTP fi or file manager in your hosting panel I have already logged into my hosting panel I scroll down and uh, let me find okay file manager uh, okay public.html and this is the subdomain if you're uh, using this SSL certificate for the uh, for the primary domain then you need to create a folder right here but uh, since I'm using this one for my subdomain uh, then this is the folder for the subdomain I click on this and then uh, Okay, step three, navigate to your domain and subdomain, create a folder that well known. Let me copy this and I create a new folder here. I name it dot uh, well known, create. Great, and we need to create another folder with this name inside the folder we created already. And now we need to upload the downloaded file, the HTTP challenge inside. All right, uh, let me drag and drop the file. Okay, so this step is done. Now I go back to WP encryption and just like click verify challenge. All right, we just verified our domain. Now, uh, you can see these are the certificate files. We need to copy the, the content of this certificate 
security certificate files and you should paste it in my uh, SAP domain. Okay, let me copy this. Now, let me go to my uh, hosting account. I click on SSL. And I have two domains here. This one is socials.net, which is the main domain, the primary domain. I click manage. Now you can see for my primary domain, I have lifetime certificate. But this is the sub domain. Uh, I don't have any certificate for this one. Uh, by the way, here it is uh, a video on the top right. You can click and watch that how to create a sub domain. Uh, you can watch that one. Uh, here you have two options. If you want to purchase a certificate from your hosting account, then you can purchase. It is around uh, 11, 12 US dollar, the price, but we are using the free one. So we just say import SSL. The first one is, okay, certificate, uh, which we have just copied the file. I just paste it here. Another one is the private key. Let's go back and copy the private key, this one and uh, let me close this window and paste it right here and another one is the certificate authority bundle just copy this one okay and go and paste it right here click install certificate your ssl is now installed and we have automatically forced https on your domain you can use it yeah now it is great so yeah that is a uh, ssl certificate now for both of my domain my primary domain and sub domain it is installed and active sometimes it takes time a uh, few like few minutes or sometimes one hour to uh, fully force the uh, uh, force the https so i think we are good to go from here so let me scroll down and click enable HTTPS now. We need to re-login. Uh, Alright, everything is perfectly done. Now let's check it. Uh, yeah, you can see at the beginning the padlock was secure, but now uh, this is because of the mixed content. Some of the, these uh, YMX and content uh, was uh, imported through HTTP. So what we need to do, we should go to the backend, that WP encryption. Let's click on force HTTPS. All right, check this one and save. Now we need to re-log in. Great. Now let's refresh. Take the assertion statement. Yes, everything is perfect. And you can see the padlock. It is showing that connection is secure. Uh, okay, uh, just remember, SSL certificate is important. Uh, uh, for the search engine specifically because Google uh, ranks the websites which are secured in uh, higher in higher ranking and uh, There's another video uh, The link is in the description also on the top right side about the used ACO uh, Used ACO plugin I have explained and uh, all the steps are explained that how to fully optimize your website for the search engine and uh, yeah, it's all for today. Thank you very much. Just comment below if there is any issue, any problem. And if it was helpful, please thumbs up and uh, make sure you subscribe. Thank you very much and have a good time.